Did you just start your coaching career? And now you're having this big dilemma because maybe for the last little while, you haven't been charging anyone for your actual coaching service, but now you're at a point where you need to start charging. And making that jump from not charging it or offering it for free to charging now is really difficult. And if you find yourself in that place, then stick around because that is what we're addressing today. I'm Karina and I help professional women make the jump from corporate into freelancing and absolutely kill it. And stay to the end because at the end I have two bonuses that I'm going to give to you about how to reprogram your mind and your brain so that you run it and it doesn't run you and you can charge the money that you want to charge for your coaching sessions. Okay, now we're going to have to address the self-worth issue because that will be a stopper. I'll tell you, for the rest of your life, we need to address it. Now we have to nip it in the butt so that it never comes back to haunt us. How can we do this? Essentially, we're going to reprogram a little bit how we think. And you might think this is difficult, but I am telling you, this is super easy. This is almost like a bonus that I'm giving to you right now. I've done this for a couple of months and I saw a huge difference immediately. I went from making zero money with my coaching business to making $5,000 a month extra in my coaching business just by doing this one thing. What's the program? Okay, here's how I want you to go about this. One, your brain is a muscle, which means that it can be trained, okay? Your brain can be trained. So you're going to be the trainer. Because here's the thing, either you train your brain or your brain is going to just do whatever it wants to do and keep thinking the negative thoughts and what I call stinking thinking and you forever will not be making money. So here's how you train, retrain your brain. I want you to get a number in your mind. What is the ideal number, the amount of money that you would love to charge for your one hour session? Well, let's start with an hour. You can have a 90 minute session, but let's do one hour. If that number for you, it's $250, let's say, because that's going to make your time worth it. Because remember, you have to prep for the coaching call. You're going to have to, to do the coaching call. You're going to have to, to then take notes, right? And make sure that you are prepared and you've given them homework. So you're doing all this brain work behind, right? It's not just a coaching call. It's all this time before and after. So let's say you're charging $250 for the coaching call. I want you to take that number, write it down, big black letters, and put it right in front of your eyes. It's wherever you sit, at your desk. Have it, $250 per session. And you're going to go and in your mind on a daily basis, just repeat, $250, that's what I charge for my coaching, $250 per hour, $250 per hour. And you're going to do this day in and day out for at least 21 days, consistently every single day. There's actually a very specific reason why women in particular tend to give their services away for free. And that's tied in 100% to your self-confidence and self-worth. You're probably not feeling confident in the fact that you can provide value to the person that you're coaching and that's reflected in the way you feel about the service that you provide. Now, there's a couple of ways that we can combat this, but I want you to think about value, the value proposition, because the last time that you've tried something for free, did you pay attention were you committed to finishing that thing or doing that thing because it was for free? You probably weren't that committed. And why is that? Well, I call it no skin in the game. You're not committed because you actually didn't pay for it. 
And so one of the things that you can actually get your clients to commit to the service that you provide or to the thing that you're trying them to get them to do is to actually pay for it. And did you notice that the more you pay for something, the more you're willing to pay attention? So if you take a course, for example, and the course costs $30 versus a course that costs $1,000, which one would you tend to finish more? Would it be the $30 course or the $1,000 course? I bet you any money, the more you paid for the course, so the one that's worth $1,000 is the one that you will pay attention to and potentially even finish. Whereas a $30, not so much value, right? It's all about perception. If we don't perceive that there is value in it and generally value is associated with money, we're just not going to, you know, take it all that seriously. So here's how you can address the number one problem, the self-confidence, the fact that, oh, I don't know if I am able to really provide a lot of value for my client yet. If you're unsure if you can, and you have to become really confident about the product that you have or the service that you have, because you're going to essentially sell it, right? But it's easier when you believe that what you have is really valuable. It's much easier to talk to people about it and spread the word about it. So here's how you can, um, how you can combat this or how you can approach it. The first way that I would do this is maybe pick two to three students, four students, where you are going to be very clear with them right at the beginning that you are going to provide your service for free and it's for a finite period of time. So maybe that's a month, okay, every week. So four sessions or two months bi-weekly, okay, eight sessions. And all of those sessions will be given to that student 100% for free. But in exchange for their testimonial. So in essence, you are doing two things. You're providing the value. You're feeling good about providing the value. You are providing it for free. So it's not that difficult yet. You are still not asking for money. But step one, you are asking for a testimonial first that will help you a lot because you will be able to put it on your website. You will be able to maybe build a great landing page where your testimonials could live and you are building now self-confidence and the fact that you are actually helping someone and in exchange, you are receiving a testimonial for that service. So it's for free, but it's not 100% for free. Be sure and grab my free guide. It's in the description below because I state step by step what you need to do to prepare to make the jump from corporate into freelancing. Okay, this is exciting. Bonus number two. And this is something so simple, but you know what? No one's doing it. I don't see anyone doing it. But when you do, it actually really quickly reprograms your thought patterns so that you can run a different story about what you're doing. And this is what I mean. Come up with a mantra for yourself. You know, I use the word mantra, but really it could just be a sentence or right? something really, really simple where you essentially tell yourself or you talk to yourself and you tell yourself, this is what's happening in my life. So let's talk about, you know, your coaching session and you start telling yourself, okay, I provide incredible value. I am a phenomenal coach and my students change their lives when they are in a session with me. That could be it. Something very, very simple. Whatever it is that that sentence is for you, but it has to be yours, right? You have to make it yours because what's gonna happen now, you repeating this to yourself, and honestly, repeat as many times as you can per day. I don't really have a number. You can do this morning to evening, where you, anytime you just have a second and you're sitting around, you know, repeat your little mantra to yourself. You reprogram the way that you think about yourself and about your coaching into thinking about it and feeling 
completely differently and more positive, right? When you feel from the bottom of your heart that you truly provide value, that you truly are an incredible coach, that even if you do, you're not that right now, you will be because your mind and the clients and your students with time will notice the change in their lives. So the moment you start to reprogram the way you think about this, th honestly, the quicker your life will change. Okay, now that you're going to start charging money for your sessions, and I know that you will because now you have this great gentle way of going from no charging anything at all to actually charging and you've got these great bonuses about how to reprogram your mind, you are ready to check out my next video about the transition from corporate into freelancer. So go ahead and check it out now.